Now, when we first started, people were coming in, and I was asking you just to write three things on a, a piece of paper, three items. Some of you did. I can't remember who, though. I'm guessing. You did, you did, you did. Thanks, there's a few over there, yeah? The idea of that was to create a list, create a box with, with some uh, objects in it. And within those objects, hopefully, we'll then use another psychological force, if you like, to try and... I was listening to some conversations out the front, and we were talking about Xbox and Black, Black Ops and that kind of thing. Just trying to, even though it sounds like random conversation, actually try and implant some, some ideas into your head when, when you filled out these forms and put on these three objects. I need someone. Terry, can you talk to me? <laughs> Having to put your pint down for a minute was just testing, wasn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Terry, you're gonna take a chair. And just relax. These were written by people as they, as they came into the door or they were at the bar, etc. Do you want to change your mind at all? No. Nobody ever does. No. Okay. <laughs> for the first time then, Kerry, just feel free to uh, open that piece of paper for me. If you can open it and then just hide it with your hands or just so that we can't see what it says. I'll come down here a bit as well. And we want to talk about body language. I'm going to watch you and everybody else is going to watch you as well. And we're just going to see if we can tell your body language, kind of what you're thinking. So, I want you to picture the first thing that's on that piece of paper. And I want you to make that picture as bright and as colourful and as animated as you can. Can you see her eyes going left, right, as she's trying to create the picture? Excellent. It's, it's something for a family. Yeah? Good? Phew. And if we... Uh, Okay, so it's not like sitting down and having a meal or anything else. They're, they are energetic, aren't they? It's, so the, the Black Ops bit was, was kind of close, I think. Like if, if I was to say a Nintendo Wii, would that be right? That would be right. That's number one. Okay. That's, that's one of three, and there's another one on there. If you can have a look at the second one for me. You know what it is? I think so. You think so? Okay. If you can make the... The picture in your mind again for me. Just well, it's quite big, this, isn't it? Yeah. And I can I can see through it in places, so that doesn't really make sense. It's not, it's not just a big pane of glass, though, is it? It's, there's there's four wheels, so it's got to be a car. Does it, does it say what kind of car it is? Can you just take me round the front or round the back so I can see either the badge or the name? Fantastic, thank you. Okay, I've, I'm going to go with a big car. I, I think something like a Volvo Estate, a red one perhaps. Was it red or? I didn't say. Didn't say. I, I, I think probably, I'm guessing it was a, it was a red Volvo Estate, but Volvo Estate's pretty good and you're still not clapping. <laughs> Okay, the third one then, two out of three, I'm loving this game so far. Um, if you can just picture this for me, the third thing on that list. Can you do me a favour, just take a deep breath, close your eyes, and then you can open your eyes again and exhale. But I've, I've, just got, I've still got Volvo Estate somewhere in there. You okay? Yep. Third image. If you can just picture that nice and big for me. It's not, it's not as big as the last image though, is it? it the object is much smaller. I'm, I'm kind of feeling... Is it just like a piece of music? 
So if I was to say it was it was like a CD, I, I, I get the feeling it's an old piece of music as well. So if Bach, maybe no, maybe Beethoven. I, I'd say Beethoven. <coughs> no, <laughs> not Beethoven. Um, okay, two hours. well, I should have stopped at two hour three. I guess. <laughs> can, can you tell me what it is? It's um, Eurythmic Sweet Dream. Eurythmic. Yeah. <laughs> Eurythmic. Not Beethoven. No. You sure? Yeah. Okay. Well, I'll, I'll take I'll take two out of three this time. But, uh, <laughs> <laughs> I think I was right about the old. Right. <laughs> Terry, can I, can I just ask you your favourite for the rest of the show? Can you just hold on to that, that envelope for me? It's sealed and signed on the back as well. That that signature there is worth at least fifty pence on eBay. So hold on to it. And uh, if, if you can just hold on to that, we'll come back to it somewhere later on in the in the show. But for now, Terry's been fantastic. Give her a big round of applause. <laughs> <laughs> able to take that subconscious answer. Those that sat down when I said, did you think of red? Those that then sat down when I said, did you change your mind to blue? Those that then sat down when I said, did you change your mind again and think of purple? When we talked outside and we were talking about Xbox and the three objects and those kind of things, we're all leading us to one goal, and that one goal is in Kerry's hand, hopefully. And you still got my envelope. Do you want to come up? I'm so excited I, I could... No, I won't. <laughs> no, please don't. <laughs> no, I won't. We wouldn't get out of the back. <laughs> Kerry, you've had this envelope throughout the evening. It was stuck to the front of the stage before we even started. And what happened was, if you took this piece of paper out of the box that was sealed, and we know it was sealed because it was a bloody pain joyful, really, wasn't it? And when we took that piece of paper out, I asked you if you wanted to change your mind, and you said, no, I don't want to change my mind. And I said, well, that's fine, because nobody ever does want to change their mind. And then we went through, and through the images, you thought of a, a wee first, which was other papers, you thought of a Volvo estate, I think it's a red Volvo estate, but I'm not sure whether it was red. And then, well, we don't want to talk about the rest of that trip, do we? No. Um, so inside your envelope should be some blank pieces of paper. Feel free to open it. You just ruined the 50 piece image you could have had on eBay. There are blank pieces of paper. And just feel free, flick through the pieces of paper, they're all blank. And, that, and that's just to tell you what we started with, we started with blank pieces of paper, we cut them into pieces, we asked people to write down three objects. The first one was a weed, the second one was a Volvo estate, and the third one was some song by Eurythmic. <laughs> Sweet dreams. <laughs> Sweet dreams, Fleck. What else is in the envelope? Okay, there's a CD. Excellent. Can you do me a favour? With, with the help of the uh, ever infamous Paris, it will lead you to his CD deck. And if you can just put it in his CD deck and just play it for me, that'd be great. On there is a kind of prediction, a kind of premonition, a lead, the way I led you through all that randomness for one particular point. And when you're ready, just hit the play button. I played the off the whole three and a half minutes, but to be honest, I think we've got the effect. Kerry, you've been amazing. Next time I'll pick Marilyn Manson, I promise. But <laughs> 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 <laughs>